take this to the drive thru? Oh, yeah, it's great. That's awesome. All right, so we're here now. We got Randy Bear 5000. We got the Lincolnator back there. He's in the back seat. He's messing with something. And of course, we got the McDon making everything better today. I know you're not supposed to have fire next to gas pumps, but. <laughs> oh, I hate the wrapper. Yankee T! If you had one thing that you could say right now, what would it be? You're late. Good morning, Internet. Welcome to another adventure. Today, I'm with the yeah, Yager Group. My man, the Flex. Believe it or not, we've got RBK out here. Rainy Bear 5000. You got a brand new Voss helmet. You got a brand new, a brand new 450X. He's a brand new bear. You think we'll find any bacon? Lots. All right, let's go. <laughs> Papa Prius got us here nice and safe thanks to the Kendon trailer. This trailer is freaking hilarious. First of all, everybody takes pictures of me. So if you don't like your photo being taken without your consent, don't buy this trailer. But if you do, you need one of these trailers. Oh, come on. <laughs> Sorry. What the hell is this? What? Yo, do you hear that? You guys gotta get on a different frequency now. Delink, listen to this. <laughs> what the hell? Nope. Stupid. Not even close. Woo! Come on, come on! Oh no, this is tough up here. I can tell. It's slippery. <laughs> I can't believe I made that. We got like a whole village down there. Check it out. They're living that easy life. That good life. That life where you don't like anybody. So you gotta live as far away from humans as you possibly can life. Which is respectable. Sometimes I don't like people either. Last time I took this thing up it felt way better than mine. I gotta stand up. <laughs> I was just sitting down and losing control. Yeah, this bike's way better than mine, dude. This bike is way nicer. It just feels so much more put together. It feels a lot smaller, a lot lighter, but more power at the same time. Just all good things to say about this bike. Shout out to Honda for letting us borrow these things. They offered to let me borrow whatever I want. I haven't taken them up on it yet, just because I don't want to risk breaking something. But apparently they don't even care because the link destroys his and they don't seem to really even mind. I just feel so much safer on it, you know? It's like riding in a safe, brand new airplane 737 MAX 8 compared to one of the old trusty reliable ones. You know, you feel safer in the new one, right? Or you're supposed to. So how do you feel about it? I love it. You love it? You want to eat it? I want to, I want to eat it. Good morning, Internet. Welcome to another adventure. Today, we're going to climb up this freaking badass hill. Here we go. didn't make it but that was like my fault that was definitely my fault this is a 250 I feel way more power than my 450 
way more power. It doesn't even make any sense. I swear, these newer Hondas, my bike's what, like an 05 or 07, something like that. It might be an 08 even, actually. It's an 11 year old bike. This is a 2019. It's not even comparable. We got some copies. We got some copies. I bet you they're gonna pull us over. Watch. We got a wheelie next to the train. That's what Delink said we have to do today. Imagine this thing just falls over on me. Look at this freaking thing. This is so cool. Technically, I did wheelie. It was just for like a half second. We can't go up here? No, operating any motor vehicle in the state of California without a license is a violation of that, right? Oh my god. You're not allowed to leave that staging area and you're only authorized to operate your vehicles north from that staging area. Oh. Yeah. Not intended. Okay. We're pretty new at this stuff. We are. We're right. curving out. There's a big sign right on your right. All will pass by. Matter of fact, this is my first day riding through bike. Consider this a verbal warning, all right? Yeah, for sure. Make sure you pay attention to the signs, all right? Thank you. You understand that? Yep. Let's go look at the train, he said. <laughs> I was trying to do a wheelie next to the train, like you said. I was up there doing them. Let's get out of here before they change their mind. Thank you, sir. Apparently there's a sign that says you can't leave this area. I don't see it. Oh, is it that little stupid sign? That's dumb. He gave us a map. That's so good. Oh, crap. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. Yeah. Oh, no way. That's a cliff. Uh, you know what? I mean, why not? Why not? I gotta get around this fence to get out of here, but I'm gonna get so stuck right now. I'm on somewhat of a cliff. Oh, come on. I'm so screwed now. <laughs> oh geez, that gets crazy down there. That gets crazy down there. Oh my God. See, I don't think I want to end up down in there because it gets really crazy right about there like there's no way i could even make it problem is it looks like that's exactly where i'm heading unless i can keep left oh here we go here we go keep it going keep it going oh man oh shit just remember i'm doing this for the entertainment so that you guys don't have to oh my god Whew. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so stupid. Why do I do these things? Why? Just why? These are the crazy flowers that people are coming here to see. 
people are literally coming in droves just to take photos of these stupid flowers. They're really rare. The only reason that they're here is because it's been raining all winter long and it never does that. So yeah, rare flowers. So I think there's two ways that this can go right here. I can either end up down there and if I go down there, I'm going to be in trouble or I can end up over this hill right here, which it looks like it's going to be really hard for me to do, but I think I'll be in a lot better spot if I can make it over there. Come on. Ah. Not off to the best start. All right, the next option is to turn the bike on. Crap, where's this stupid thing? No, I need that thing. Yeah, I hear your bikes over there. I, I'm just taking a break. I just wanted to let you know I'm good. I'm not dead. I'm pissed because I lost that stupid thing that goes over my gas cap. And I love that thing. Yeah, like what the hell, dude? That thing sucks anyway. It always falls off. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Oh crap, dude, I'm leaking. I'm straight leaking. Dude, I've been leaking for a while, huh? I can't keep leaking like that. I'm gonna run out of gas. All right, so I just need to get over there somehow and not down there. You know what, screw it, we can get up there. What is this, freaking amateur hour? I could go down there too. See, that looks safe. A lot better than down in there. See all those big rocks? I would have been screwed. Oh no. I thought this was something. This is nothing. Crap. Oh my god. I made it. That was literally every biker's worst nightmare. Just getting stuck in the middle of nowhere. Well, I made it, there they are. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Okay, no more. Yeah. I think I might have ran out of gas. Alright, I'll swing down. I have a siphon. You have a siphon? Yeah. You do? God. Why? For reasons like this. Fuck, well, it didn't work. It's all in my mouth. <laughs> it's pull the hose out. The source has to be higher. Yeah, pull the hose out. It instantly dried up my lips, dude. I've never had that happen before. I can't do that the whole time. It's kind of working. Yeah. Woo! Alright, well. The Iggy T has my gas cap. I don't know why. But, oh crap, this is gonna spill fuel like everywhere, isn't it? Look at this. Look what I'm doing right now. Just don't crash. Just don't crash. Just don't crash. Crap, he crashed. I need him out of my way. Woo! All right. Okay, we made it. Papa probably used Gordini. Papa Gordini, Gordini, Gordini. Oh my god. What a day. This is what happens when you run into Yegi T. He comes at the break of dusk and steals your fuel cap. Takes off into the sunset. <laughs> I don't even understand. Randy Bear! Yeah. What do you think, dude? Good day. Everything you'd hope for? Sure, yeah. So you were a big rider back in the day. It's been, what, 10 years or so? About that. Did it come right back? Nope. I'm sore. A couple more days, man. You'll, you'll bounce right back. Listen to him. <laughs> you do this again? I'm sure we'll have to. Listen yeah. to him. Yeah. Look at I've never seen him so dirty. Listen. The dirty bear. All right. 5K. Hey, Caleb, fun as always, man. You're doing some crazy shit, dude. Uh, Jaeger Toop, nowhere to be found. He 
went to the pawn shop and sold a gas cap. All right, here's the soup. This is the soup that Delink was raving about all day long. Like he just kept on talking about it. And he offered me to have, have a little taste. A little taste of the soup. Okay, this is my taste of the soup. All right, here's what we got. We got this pulled pork and we got some Delink stuff. Does that to your we, got, face. we got some cheesy Delink. Delink doesn't want us to see, so he's hiding it. Can't then we got the Yeggy tea burg Then we got the bread. Then we got the tattoos. Oh, oh, and then we got the bear. The bear's munching on some meat. Watch the bear eat. I know, why didn't you go and watch oh, it? But yeah, you made it. It's the next video now. You gotta go watch the last video. If you're ever gonna try to park like this just to save yourself from having a car park next to you, I'm gonna freaking squeeze on in there. Screw you over. Hello. Hello, dear. Are you by any chance my videos? Are you by any chance my videos? Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping? Are you so sleepy? You look so sleepy, Biz. Were you taking a nap? You were taking a snooze? Come here, let's go potty. Come on. Go potty. Hey. She saw a rabbit. She's a good girl. She didn't chase it. Okay, there's too much going on out there. Too much activity. Everyone was afraid. They're like, what's this big old people doing with no leash? What's the big people doing with no leash? We gotta go for a real walk, babes. But first, I got a very special and important question for you. And it goes, does she want yummies? <gasps> does she want yummies? Yeah, the bitch does. You ready? All right, what I'm gonna need you to do it's actually a very important sequence of events. You're gonna have to go all the way over there. Then you're gonna have to sit. Now you're gonna have to stay. Now you're gonna have to sit back down. Good good girl, Very proud of you, Biz. I saw you with your walker. You were doing such a good job. You got some pictures. You were rolling in the grass. The Biz was rolling in the grass. <gasps> what? Do we have a pooping Biz? A pooping Biz? We got a pooping Biz on the loose, everybody. Make sure to call your local authorities. Let them know so we can catch this pooping Biz and we can just squeeze it all day long. You did a good job, Bales. You did a good job on the walkies. Can you come here? Can you sit? Good girl. And can you stay? You gotta wait. No, no, no. You're supposed to be staying, Bales. Sit. Okay, now wait. Leave it there. Good girl. Very good girl, Bales. Okay, that's gonna do it. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Bales, come here. Come here. Hi, Vibs. Vibs came to the rescue. Yeah, I'm so tired. I gotta go to bed because I'm freaking exhausted because I haven't ridden dirt bikes in a long time. But that was fun. That was a good day of riding. I'm very happy and I'm so glad that the Bear 5000 showed up. He showed along. He tagged along for the ride. And I'm sure there's gonna be some more to come, at least while I'm still here with the Bear 5000. All right. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. We're going to end with the cocky boys over here. Cocky boy Lewis and cocky boy Rogan Hauer. And uh, which one should I end in on? Cocky boy Lewis, Rogan Hauer, Rogan Hauer, Lewis. Brrr.